Hello, Simmers. Seaweed from Tribal Soup Project here. Welcome to another episode of Simsational. You're watching the All Things Custom and Modsational series, and today I'm going to tell you about a mod that made me really happy when I discovered it. And that mod is the Video Station Faster Record, Edit, and Combine Video mod by Soul Killer. And if you don't know how to install mods, I will show you how to do that at the end of this video. But yeah, so this video does exactly what the title says. It makes recording and editing your videos way faster. And the really cool thing about this mod is you can actually, it has several different things that you can download. And the difference between them is how fast it takes you to record and edit your videos. So if you want to just be able to get it out of the way and do it super, super duper fast, you can do that. And if you just want to do it just a little bit faster than the snail space is which it usually goes, you could do that too. And that's basically it, guys. Up next is how to install the mod. In order to install custom content and mods into your game, you first must enable them to work by coming up here to the options menu and under game options, you're going to click on the other tab. This enable custom content and mods and script mods allowed boxes need to be ticked. Be sure to apply your changes and then you're ready to completely exit out of your game and install the mod. Now that we've enabled mods and custom content to work in our game, we are ready to go ahead and install the Video Station Faster Recording, Edit, and Combine Videos mod by Soul Killer. And you are going to come to this page, which I will link down into the description below. And you're going to scroll down a bit and you are going to click on this Files button. Here's where you get to pick how much faster you want the video station to be able to record and edit. You can um, have it do two times, four times, six times, eight times, or ten times faster. You, it's very important that you only install one of these. If you install more than one of them, then it is not going to work. So I'm going to go ahead and choose this ten times faster. And my zip file opener opens up automatically, but if yours does not open up automatically like mine does, you'll see where it downloads at the bottom of the page here, and you simply are going to double click on it when it's done downloading in order to open this. So now I'm going to come to my Windows Explorer, and I am going to nav nav navigate to Documents, Electronic Arts, The Sims 4, then mods and i am simply going to drag this mod over to my mods folder and that's it and i'm ready to go back into my game now that i've rebooted my game this little window pops up that does not usually pop up all this is is it's telling you what kind of custom content and mods that you've successfully installed so i'm simply going to click on the check mark to acknowledge and I am ready to go back into my game. It was that simple, guys. I hope you enjoyed the video as well as learned something from watching it. If you did like the video, please be so kind as to hit that thumbs up button and give us a like. Subscribe to the channel if you've not already. Be sure to hit that bell if you never want to miss a video. Check out the website. Follow us on Facebook and Twitter. And until next time, guys, happy simming and I'll catch you all later. Goodbye!